everyone and welcome. So today is part one of my doodle bug haul videos. Um, I got most of this from a D-stash um, Leslie at Leslie's Crafts and Gifts um, did. Um, she's been doing a lot of D-stash videos lately so I will link her YouTube video in the description box below. I also got a couple of bits from Cheryl Simone Craft Store. Um, I am subscribed to her newsletter so um, I got a lovely offer the other day and a reminder of that offer so I ended up collecting and um, getting a couple bits of things from there so I will just point out what I got from Shell's um, store um, because Le Leslie doesn't have that in her D stash or in her store either um, so yeah but most of it came from lovely Leslie so let me show you what I've got so in this one I'm just going to show you some of the accessories and the six by six and also um, a couple of the freebies that um, Leslie gave me for getting, um, I've, I've got quite a big bundle, hence why this is all in different parts. I didn't want to overwhelm anyone. So um, I'll start off with this washi tape. This washi tape is from um, the Lots of Love collection and this is one of the things I got from Cheryl Simone's um, store. I actually missed out on this when the collection came out last year. So you may have seen this um, a few times. It's their most recent um, Valentine's one. I don't think they're going to be bringing one out because they released something different this time. It's like a calendar kit. Um, but I absolutely love this washi tape. So it actually um, breaks off and you can use them as like little stamps. So when you just tear the washi, it's like this. So cute. And I'm really happy that Cheryl um, was able to stop this back in again. So I ended up getting some of that. So that's what I got from Cheryl's store. Now from Leslie, um, <laughs> this came in two bundles. So I actually bought two bundles. Um, and I've actually, I've merged them all together now. So I don't know what came in which bundle. But um, I've got four doodle pops. And I think I only have one of them. I think I have this one. So three of them are new to my collection and I love Doodle Pops. They are like my collector's cards. <laughs> I guess, you know, some people collect football cards or baseball cards or Pokemon cards. I think I collect Doodle Pops um, because they're absolutely gorgeous. So there's like cute toaster, the little Chinese takeaway, it's typewriter with the letter and the soda pops. So cute. I love their adorable faces. And then we have the um, sprinkles. So we have this one, which has got all the sweeties on it. We've got the gummy bears and licorice, all sorts in beautiful pastel colours. And got the glitter sprinkles. So these are like enamel dots, but they've got so much, so much sparkle inside them, like an iridescent sparkle. And then this is the breakfast buddies. So we've got fried eggs and bacon, pop tarts and waffles, and then the cute little toaster. And then this one is the takeaway one. So we've got pizza, and we've got Chinese food, we've got soda, we've got sushi, and we've got like little hearts in the middle, they're so cute. And a little soy sauce. <laughs> so adorable. So they're like the accessories to like the doodlebug collections which um, I don't often always get, but they are they are cute. And I do use the sprinkles as well. So Leslie actually gave me some freebies. And one of those things was this um, So Punny Chit Chat. Um, I love the So Punny collection. And um, I've only ever had the odds and ends. So it was really nice to get the Chit Chat because it's something that I didn't have and I was totally unexpected. So thank you so much for that, Leslie. I really do appreciate it and it's got lots of valentine's themes because this was a valentine's day collection back in um, 2017 so we've got valentine my love xoxo <laughs> very useful for a uh, prompt that uh, hillary's done uh, for her alphabet um lots of you know the, the speech bubbles um lots of puns yeah really adorable adorable um chit chat so thank you so much leslie and also she gifted me this paper pad which is called cream and sugar and this actually has a very special place in my heart so this was the actual paper pad that got me into doodlebug in the first place 
um, somebody had sent me, I think he may, might have been an ATC, um, with one of the images on and that was it. I was in love. I went hunting and this was what I found and I ended up buying a 6 by 6 paper pad. I've probably even got scraps of it right now. <laughs> um, this is like back from 2017. Uh, this came out 2016. So it's quite an oldie, but absolutely gorgeous. So I'm going to flick through the pages so you can see them. Absolutely beautiful. So we've got the icons with all the coffees and teas and the cakes and everything. And then I'll put it this way and then you'll be able to see both at the same time. So we've got the circles and then we've got these tiny little hearts. Oh, and then we have these little cutter parts. I love this. I could make this because I have bought a stand like this recently in a dies. I also have the cake things as well. So I, I love replicating um, these images. They give me such inspiration. And lovely red hearts there as well. On the back, they can make like little um, cards. My favourite thing, sweet memories, I love you because cute coffee, coffee mugs, I think it was the coffee mug that got sent to me, I don't even like coffee, <laughs> and then they got the coffee beans, the stripes, oh beautiful imagery, life is sweet, the donut. Sprinkles, love hearts, and then we have more cutter parts, and sentiments, hugs and kisses, we are made for each other, be mine, sugar and spice, and everything nice, so happy together. It's so adorable. Lovely flowers. And then we've got like this baby pink grids, and then we've got the hot pink with all the icons just like oh dear <laughs> there we go that shows how old <laughs> the glue has given up um with that mini icons and then we've got the plaids and the teacups the strips and then this one has lots and lots of tiny xos on it hugs and kisses We've got some lovely hearts and the baby pink with white spots, red stripes, and then we're back at this beginning with the icons, and then it just repeats itself, I think, twice. So absolutely wonderful. And this was a freebie, so I haven't even got into the actual things that I purchased. Um, and I'm just gonna today show you the other two pads that were in there, and um, these were the six by six pads that were in the distache. Um, one is fairy tales and the other one is down on the farm and um, two collections that I've never had before so this is one of the main reasons why I wanted to get these because um, even though I do have a lot of doodle bug stuff now um, I didn't I didn't have these collections any of these collections so um, it wasn't like I was doubling up on anything that much apart from maybe two things that I got from Cheryl um, and yeah, so I was really, really happy that to have things that I don't have anymore. And the Do The Bug collaboration definitely taught me to um, use my stuff, not hoard my stuff. So I think the more I have, the more I feel like using. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'm absolutely obsessed with this one because of how adorable these animals are. The little piggy has like, he's got my heart. <laughs> he's captured me. We've got this gingham and the plaids so beautiful and then we have this lovely blue with the mini icons and then who's the pig in the mud <laughs> he's so cute <laughs> and then we have this one which reminds me I think they're like um handkerchiefs <laughs> like cowboy handkerchiefs and then this cow he's so cute 
and then we have this cow print we've got this um icon page which is full of the farmland so we've got the barns in there the stables the pond the farmer's house the farmer the farmer's wife <laughs> the well the cows the plants the trees everything everything's going on in this farm and then we have the strips and i'm just obsessed with oink 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 <laughs> um i live actually quite near the countryside so there are multiple um farms around me and it's just literally like um just my whole childhood like i just love watching the animals like literally down the end of where i grew up on the road even though it was like an, a housing estate um there was literally a farm because <laughs> the farmer just refused <laughs> so we used to go and like um help out with the cows and stuff and oh just just so many nice memories and then this one looks like jeans pocket and i love the little um red <laughs> tag there with the heart i think we all know what brand they're implying and the chickens i actually used to have chickens um when i lived i had a much much bigger garden i don't have one now um I, but my mum does have chickens now as well so we love having chickens around and then we have this like honeycomb print and then we have some black and white gingham and then these gorgeous little cut aparts flowers and lots of primary colors and then we've got this like wood <laughs> like uh what's it called i don't know wood 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 no it's not fully like like a tree like flooring <laughs> and the little horsies are so cute that's like a tree wood grain and then we've got gorgeous sheep coming on towards spring now so we've got lots of sheep lots of lambs lovely little grass with the daisies and we have this um like a green backing page another lime green lots of icons we've got the dog in there as well we've got uh oh and then we're back to the beginning so that is all the icons all the pages that repeats itself in the down on the farm six by six and now i'll just show you the fairy tales what's included in this one um again this is back in 2017 the down on the farm was 2018 so this one is very um <laughs> mystical fun birthday inside i think and uh, we've got like ice creams and unicorns and flowers and rainbow clouds wishing stars balloons it's really cute and you know some of the images like you know the cake um really fit in with the the cream and sugar as well so that's one thing i love about doing the book is that it doesn't matter how old a collection is or how new a collection is everything the color the color wall to do the book is the same um the imagery it changes a little bit but you will see repetitive characters come back and i just really love that i got this lovely one with like an asterisk star this one again all pink asterisk stars rainbow <laughs> stripes i love this all the balloons all the balloons look so happy and we have these stars rainbows and then these lovely polka dots these cut aparts here never let anyone dull your sparkle dream big Believe in magic, play with fairies, ride a unicorn, swim with mermaids, chase rainbows. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> and then this one has all the party icons, presents, balloons, cakes, hats. And the washi strips. Really adorable. Then we've got the unicorns with the purple clouds. We've got some 
purple with some purple like spots but like random ones and then we've got some flowers and then we have the flowers just in the orange tone on tone rainbow hearts very vibrant this pad the hot pink with the pink hearts we've got the pink castle in the blue clouds and then we've got the main image and then some polka dots more clouds clouds and stars we've got the flowers oh, purple with the clouds it's so cute and then lots of icons again and then some more cutter parts oh that's the beginning again <laughs> i'm getting too carried away so yeah that is the fairy tales absolutely beautiful and i i did get some odds and ends for that and um back when i got the cream of sugar but i don't think i have that many left maybe one or two that i clung on to so yeah um this is um my part one <laughs> of the um haul that i've done for the doodle bug um and then tomorrow i'll be back to show you part two um which will be all the stickers the um the mini icons and the icon stickers that i've got as well so thanks for joining me today. I'll see you again soon. Take care. Bye.